Yo, what is up, my crazy subscriber? This is Joking John 34 here, bringing us more Man 15 Ultimate Team games. Today, we're gonna be playing game number eight and also game number nine. The reason why there's two games is because my first opponent on game number eight ended up quitting the game on kickoff, so that gave me the free win. And I'm gonna show you guys right now, so you guys can see that I'm not, you know, cheating or disconnecting glitch or some bullshit, you know. I'm going to show you guys what actually happens so you guys can see that I'm not pulling anything off. So, because I'm, I'm loyal, guys. I'm actually loyal. I'm not cheating or anything. I'm showing you guys that I'm a straight-up player here in Madden. So, as you can see, I ended up kicking the ball. As you can see, his, his initials are right there, FDU. He just returns it right. He's, there's no problems going on. There's no fumbles. Regular tackle. A 17-yard gain. I'm like, yeah, okay, let's start this game up. Let's see what we got. And the guy ended up pausing, and I was like, all right, maybe he's checking out my roster or something like people normally do. I don't know why the hell they would do that. And he ended up quitting the game, and I was like, what? Did I do anything wrong? <laughs> so I ended up checking the, the history, and as you can see, I won 0-0. Zero, zero. And I ended up qualifying for the playoffs, and I was like, damn, that's a cheap win. It's not cool, man. <laughs> now I feel bad. Now I, I go into the playoffs with no momentum. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to try my best on my next two games. And let's see if I can get that first round by. Because it's just this is just too easy. That's the easy way out. I don't want to win like that. So anyways, on my next game, as you can see, right in the first play, my defense just popped the crap out of Chris Johnson. Taking it all the way with Hello Dinata. Nice job by my free safety. He's waking up. I don't know what the hell happened to him. But for the past four seasons, that guy... Uh, what was his name? Eric Reed has never done anything for my team until this season. I'm really surprised what he's doing. So uh, that was a nice force fumble by him. So now the score is 7-0, third and third. And the guy just ends up, you know, calling in short plays. And most of the time, that's why the, the video name is called uh, Crow Route Lover or something. You know, I'm going to name it some, something, uh, you know, that's pretty much with Crow Routes. The guy just called that Crow Route so many times. It's just... It just took away so much time from the game. And you guys you guys can actually tell how much minutes did I take away. Look at the minute time. Look at the timer. You guys can be able to, can be able to see how many you know plays did I take away. Because the guy just took so little to advance that you know I had to take away like, like, like a lot of footage. So um, anyways, the guy ended up scoring out of the crow route with uh, Julian Edelman. A nice job by him, I guess. You know he's, he's reading that defense pretty well. So I gave him credit for that. Third and four, couldn't convert. Fourth and four, let's see what we do. A little bit of a headback screen, but my freaking running back ended up getting stuck with one of the guards, and I was like, God damn it. We're not going to do this bullshit again. Come on, man. <laughs> so, anyways, I could have just popped him right there. Antonio Cromartie ended up injuring one of the receivers. Fourth and two, will he convert? 48 seconds to go, seven to seven. Does a little bit of a play action. Lobs it up to the left side. Antonio Cromartie, 83 overall cornerback intercepts the ball the guy still has it and he, most of you guys were telling me to replace that corner he is still the beast man he's still badass i don't know how he does it seriously I'm, i don't know <laughs> he still gets those picks man so he, he is a great cornerback anyways before the half i lob it up to reggie wayne and nothing he had it in his hands i was, was like what the hell reggie when that was all yours that was supposed to be a touchdown but i guess not so on my kick return, I ended up going into revenge mode. Joe McNair taking it almost all the way. The fat kicker ended up getting freaking Joe McNair. I was like, ah, oh, five yards away, close to the touch. So I was like, you know what? The ball never lies. I'm supposed to score. Scoring with CJ Anderson. Nice blocking right there by my tight ends, Mercedes Lewis. That was just a nice pop by him. Anyways, then ended up ended up back on defense. The Montre Moore, my defensive end got tired because this guy just kept on calling curl routes. Um, the Montre Moore ended up stepping in. Nice sack by him. Now fourth and two, and another curl route. <laughs> That's all he called in, and you should be able to see that again on this play again. You know, there's some few curl routes going on there, or some slams. And no, Terrell Suggs ended up popping his legs up, and the ball ended up fumbling. And I ended up recording with Luke Kuechly. Nice job, but Terrell Suggs right there. Uh, little, I'm just watching my passes right here, just advancing little by little strategically. A little bit of a play action, square wide open, but I ended up throwing 2x by accident. I press, you know, I double press the button. I don't know why the hell I did that, but my tight end, Dave Casper, ended up catching the ball. I was like, wow, that's fucking clutch, man. CJ Anderson with a nice halfback misdirection towards the outside, nine yard gain. Uh, I think it's like 31. Oh, never mind, I did convert. Second and six. Nice pass down the middle, 14 to 7. What I'm gonna do there? What I'm gonna do? Have back misdirection towards the right side. CJ Anderson gets the ball. An easy run to the right side. That was pretty much of a smooth sailing right there. 
20, 1 to 7, 1 minute and 27 seconds to go. He lobs it up to Deion Sanders. Antonio Cromartie doesn't jump for the ball. I swear to God, guys, I was holding triangle with like freaking. I was pressing triangle so hard, like, why the hell didn't he jump? So, anyways, the ball never lies. As you can see, one down, two down, third and 10. Will he convert third and 10? Nope, rejected. Another block by my defensive back. Fourth and 10. What's going to happen on fourth and 10? Was the fourth one going to be good? No. Lance Briggs with the interceptions on the 50 second mark. The game is over. 21 7. All I need to do is just run the ball. He's going to call timeout. Nope. He ended up not calling timeout. I ended up running down the clock, as you can see on the clock. 17 seconds to go. I ended up winning the game 21 7. So this curl lover, man, this is like one of my first, man. I never, never, I never faced anybody like this. What kind of offense is that? But it's perfect against the 4-3. I mean, the cover three, I mean, and I understand why he did it. You know, he probably did face a lot of cover three defenses and he learned the ways of deep beating that defense. So now I know something. Now I learned something new. So I'm going to take some of his plays and do it against cover threes now. So, hey, you guys can learn something from your opponent sometimes. So that's it. We ended up winning. Our record right now is currently 8-1. and one. We are ready to advance to the next game, and hopefully we get the first round by. So subscribe for more. If you guys want to see more Ultimate Team.